All right, I said I was done, but we're doing one more target. All right, we're here for another toy hunt. Uh, today is going to be a lot of targets. I am currently on the hunt for still the Masters of the Universe TMNT stuff for Jamar, and I think maybe Nate. I don't know. I need to ask him if he still needs them. But I saw that the Jada Toy Street Fighter Ken figures are starting to hit, and I need to go hunt that down. So hopefully we can come across that. But uh, yeah, let's go get started. We are here at Target. Once again, still on the hunt for some Motu Turtles and for Street Fighter Ken. So let's go inside and see if we can find something. All right, so we actually have some new stuff here. There's this new, like, I assume it's part of like, the kids line, but it's Acto 1. Got a cool little drone trap. That's fun. Comes with, kind of weird that Slimer doesn't have. Oh, it's because he's like gooey. That's weird. Okay. Well, it's fun seeing new Ghostbusters toys. Hopefully, they'll bring back the Plasma series and we can get more stuff from that. Looks like Wanda got put back on uh, full price despite not selling. And there's still poor Peg Warmer MJ. Oh, the new. Uh, re-releases. Wow, that's a really, really good like, like, did a great job like updating that. <clears throat> Man, that's really impressive. I was not expecting that at all. Uh, got some X-Men. Triple Bubble. Got... Officers and Copperhead and then Vipra Power Rangers Aquaman BP Superman Weird Barnacle Man Donna Troy um, Random Princess Leia Aquaman, but this one's comic book. Chubby Cheek Superman. I've got more of the same Transformers. He might be new. Galvatron, I don't think I've seen him here yet. Let's find him. Yeah, just more him. side here. So we've got, looks like dinosaurs are restocked a bit. Etch a sketch, did not expect to see that. Let's see here. Yeah, same stuff. No Motu turtles though. I do have the mutant mutation Mikey, Raph, and Leo. The Sunman sent more Sunman. His wings look really cool. Uh, there's Jitsu, Baby Turtles, Real Shutter. Bo-Katan, AW figures, a bunch of, Jesus Christ, why is this retro line still either? Is there people actually collecting it? Some Black Series, new and old, Croissant Witch, Sabine, Tuscan Raider, uh, or a little bit of random AJ back there. They do have the new Legends. That's fun, Iron Sheik. There's Hogan and his cape. Uh, all right, well, on that note, I'm gonna go back to the NECA section and see if we can find Ken.
All right, so I wasn't able to record in the NECA section because there were some people back there and they were being loud and it just went pointless, but no luck. So off to the next place. All right, here's some place we haven't been in a couple weeks. Uh, hopefully means there's some restocks. However, it looks like there's a sign that, that's handwritten that says all toys 33% off, which gives me very, very low hope. So let's go take a look. All right, so it looks like they still have the end cap of the same three waves of Marvel Legends. And I've definitely condensed everything down because there's nothing up front now. Got the Mo2 Battle Cat and Panther section, the Wind Raider, and that cool looking snake from the show that Nate likes. Oh, look at that. Some dinosaurs, that's fun. Hmm. Got Iron Man, some of those weird mech strike figures, cartoon D&D. &D. Uh, this side, there's all the cars. Not really much here so far. I've got these shredding sharks. It's kind of fun, even though I'm pretty sure that's a whale. Killer waves. That's a killer whale, not a shark. So, kind of lost the concept there. Got Moss Man. He's actually like on the pegs now, which is impressive. Got a bunch of the Zeo Yellow Ranger. Only it was the other ranger that had the effect piece I wanted. Huh. Some Pixar stuff, Beast Wars. And all the same. Superhero pets, little cars, that's fun. Fortress of Solitude and a little spaceship. Oh, that's fun. These Tim and T Mikey spin top thingy. Like they made all the turtles, foot soldier, shredder, and splinter. I'm guessing this is supposed to be from the 2012 series based off the artwork. Which is awesome. We've got some McFarlane. All of them are black app. They don't even have a uh, snowsuit Batman anymore. We've got a very small amount of Ghostbusters, so hopes of finding Winston even lower. I might just have to Go on Amazon and pay the 16 bucks instead of the eight. That sucks. Tiny He-Man. Some of the kid stuff. Got some O2 with the flippy bits He-Man. And we've got Clamp Champ. Looks like that's all they have. Oh well, that sucks. Some Danger Mouse. Got uh, Johnny Storm and Sue Storm. I'm surprised they just discount these down further. I feel like they'd probably fly off the shelves at like three bucks. Got the reminiscence of the Fortnite line. Got a bunch of the D&D &D figures still. Kind of regret not picking up Chris Pine at Ross, not gonna lie. Oh well. Because um, yeah, all they have are the same ones. As usual, only $10 now. I don't think they were $10 before. Are they raising prices on us? It's always trying to pull a Hasbro here. Yeah, it's all just the same three figures. There's more Ghostbuster ones. Uh, some Stranger Things. Grogu. Soko's. Jedi Starship, Starfighter, sorry. Uh, I don't even know if they have another aisle anymore. Do they? They do, but it's all like little kid stuff. Uh, here's this all retro figures. If you're into that. Oh, look at the tiny Lando. I think there's another end cap down here, but that's gonna be about it. Yeah, here's all the archive stuff. So, nothing new at all is at all. Well, maybe we'll give it a, a month next time before we come back or until people start posting about it again. Uh, in the meantime, I'll see you wherever I end up next.
One more target. One more. Here we are, what is affectionately known as the green target. Yeah, so this generally is a disappointing one to me because a uh, friend of the show and friend of mine, the BFC, haunts this one pretty regularly. So I do not expect to find anything. Mm -hmm. Look at the little NECA end cap here. Creature from the Black Lagoon. I haven't seen this one, I don't think. Maybe I have, I don't know. Huh? Looks pretty cool. These are definitely not for me, but they do seem pretty cool. All right, let's see here. Already a bad sign, no new Transformers. Here's the McFarlane stuff. Looks like no Batman and Robin. Okay. Same old here. Looking like the same old here, although that's kind of cool. Don't know what that is, but looks cool. W totally obliterated. Clearance stickers, but not on that point dread, although I do see slush head for sixteen forty nine. I may purchase this. Kind of hoping Batman and Robin would be over here, but that does not appear to be the case. This is like one of the smallest collector's areas too. Huh. All right, that one was kind of a bum, bummer. I did pick up the clearance slush head because. But other than that, they were really picked over and didn't have a lot. So I think I'm done. Maybe one more. Maybe. All right, we got some Micro Galaxy. Wrestlers are still pretty skim. Random Frog. Even Starship. Got so many Bo Katan. There's not much for Vintage Collection either. There's Luke, Tuscan Raider, Leia, Leia, Lando. <laughs> Random Jurassic World. Like three sections from where it's supposed to. It even has the correct tag. That's weird. There's Black Series Luke, Baby Turtles, Pizza Band, there's the Falcon, there's the Anakin and we won Jedi Starfighters, really cool Toy Story set there, that's fun, uh, four pack of the Turtles, Van, Glow in the Dark Rap, Glow in the Dark Tony, Glow in the Dark Mikey, and Glow in the Dark Leo. Hmm. They have all four of them. That's impressive. Got more of that Sun Man 3 pack. Got Motor Scooter, <laughs> Raf. There's Mato Gecko, Mutation Mikey, it's Pixar. Random assortment of turtle stuff, some turtle masks, dinosaurs, no Moto turtles again. This is so weird. I wonder why they're showing up some places and not others. Uh, well, let's go around the other side, see if we can find anything else. Alright, so another random. Micro Galaxy Squadron. We've got the new Godzilla toys. Oof. Oh god, look at that face. Oof. That is rough. 
Oh, he looks terrible too. Ooh, he's kind of cool. Oh, there's no blue, got blue Godzilla, so he starts off blue. Fanny Gauntlet, Kong, Sandman, MJ, Gamora. Wow, they've already like turned off all the clearance. Like I thought all this stuff was discount like a week ago. There's Travel Bubble, Aquaman, Necron. Got some D&D &D figures that somehow didn't make their way to Ross and Ollie's. Copperhead, Flint. I saw him for like seven dollars on another one, but it was ripped open. And I kind of regret not grabbing it because like none of these are in clearance anymore. Some Power Rangers, Dustin, more Bocatoon, Midnighter, Aquaman, Black Lantern, Batman, Black Lantern, Duststorm. Batman. Even Transformers are pretty slim pickings. Alright, well, let's go to the necro section and see if they've got Ken. Alright, so the anime section is real barren. Got some bleach and One Piece and Gundam. Terrible Joker as Batman. More DD figures. <laughs> Little rubbery Godzilla figurines. Mr. T. Sin from Spawn. Some Dune figures. Or Gamora. Monolith, who looks really cool. Dune 2 pack. There's a McFarland Dragon. So far, I'm not seeing any Street Fighter figures at all. There's some of the McFarland stuff. Super 7 reaction. Good. It's a really cool Batman. Not gonna lie. Brown start and finally make a couple of good figures here and there. I feel like it don't look terrible. Uh, I guess we'll come down here. Got good old Renette. Oh, there's our favorite pick warming demon. There's the old Earl again. I haven't seen a. Uh, Baby, Baby Sinclair, uh, Alien, Predator, E.T., Santos, Mark Gargoyles down here, so many Colossus Frog, sorry, Gizmo, got Space Usagi, surprised to see this as often as I do, I figured it would be a hot seller for being a soggy. Oh, well, we have one. It's fail along who we already have, but at least we saw something. Grim's Word. Got Nun. E.T. More Earl. Check Warming Demon. Alright. Well, that's a bust. So, I guess I'll see you at the next place. Alright. I said I was done. But we're doing one more target. We are here at Maslin Target. We're just making the rounds today all over. Probably a radius of, I don't even know how much, but it's several. So we're gonna give this one a shot. Again, I'm still looking for Robin. We'll see what happens. All right. Transformers are wrecked. Lots of McFarlane, just not the ones None of the ones I'm looking for. What do we got here? Joes are done. I don't think we're gonna see a huge amount of uh, clearance on the Python Patrol stuff. This is new. Although, I just don't see these being a big hit, but that's just me. These are $12.49, where they were $7.49 at the other one. So. Mm. And 
cap pretty empty. Let's see what we got here. We got stuff that isn't on clearance. There's the turtles and He-Man next to each other, but no masters or turtles in Grayskull. All right, well, that's fine. Don't see much in the way. Oh, I forgot to bring it. All right. Who's this guy randomly? This one's a big loser. All right, we are here at, you guessed it, another Target. Uh, I'm still looking for some Motu Turtles for Jamar and Nate and Street Fighter Ken. So fingers crossed, let's go in and see what they got. All right, so once again, wrestling section's pretty barren. Oh, we've got all the colors of the rainbow for the clone trooper ship. That's fun. Got some Landos, Croissant Witch, Obi-Wan, Lando, Sabine. We've got Hera, Chopper. We've got the Falcon. We've got that Point Dread, Sunman 3 pack. There's Mutation Leo and Mikey. We've got Wingnut. Oh, we got Piggy. Pighead. I don't think I've seen him before. This I have, I can't remember. And still, once again, no Mo2 Turtles. Did they just like get like one thing and that's it? This is, makes no sense to me. Angelo. Oof, nothing in the dinosaurs. Uh, Transformers. That's kind of cool. Got Crocodile. Uh, Tiny Rhinox. Rush, Rush. Soundwave. Starscream looking Megatron. Ironhide. Chubby Cheek Superman. Black Lantern Superman. Aquaman. 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 Black Manta. Barnacle Boy. A random bazooka? I want to see. I could probably use this for something. I want to see if it's on clearance or anything. Got. A bunch of Viper still. We've got the Python Patrol Super 7 Reaction. Trouble Bubble. We've got some $8 Legends. I'd probably, I'm gonna, if I can find, uh, what is it? Uh, is that even on there? I can't remember his name for the life of me. 
Kingpin. If I can find Pink Kingpin, I'll buy him for eight bucks just to have him for my movie Spider-Man. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna check the price on this guy and then we'll head over to the NECA section. All right, I've got some tattoo gremlins, Christmas gremlins, some gargoyles, uh, a nut, got Rat King, gargoyles, alien, Frankenstein, Doc Brown, Terminator, Phantom Casey, Wolfman, aliens, man that TV is loud, I've got Demon Boy, oh Shredder, Dracula, Phantom, PC, Ronin, is that cool Joker? Got some of the Teeny Terrors. Nightmare Spawn's pretty cool looking. Old school Superman. Terrible cell shaded Batman. Blue Beetle. Yeah, nope. Yet another disappointment. Alright, well, I'll see you guys wherever I end up next. All right, guys, that is it for the toy hunt. Unfortunately, didn't find what we were looking for, but that's kind of the name of the game, especially post Christmas and post New Year's and all that. Unfortunately, it seems like a lot of the, the clearance stuff is drying up or going off of clearance, which doesn't make any sense. Like this didn't sell, let's put it on like super discount. Oh, it still doesn't sell, let's put it back to full price. Like that doesn't make sense. Uh, but anyway, yeah. So if you enjoyed the video, please make sure to like and subscribe helps us out here in the channel and also gets you a bunch of toy related content in your feed we've got weekly toy hunts weekly live stream weekly podcasts we've got reviews we've got how to pose videos we've got all sorts of stuff gonna have some we have some customizing stuff i'm gonna hopefully start doing some how-to uh tutorials for some figure photography here soon now that i've got the setup kind of moved around but yeah so stay tuned for that uh Normally, these toy hunts are going to be me, Nate, and Jamar. I'm not sure if they got some footage or not in time. They may just be on, because we do two toy, two toy hunts a week. They may just show up for the Wednesday ones, and then Saturday might just be me. Not sure. Either way, Nate's face will always be in the thumbnail, because he is essentially the mascot. Everyone likes his face. It's very clickable. We did some science. We t tested it with both me and Jamar, and you guys don't like hooking on our faces. So, <laughs> Nate will forever be our mascot. Um, yeah, Instagram, Twitter, TikTok, at Modern Toy Fair. If you're already a fan of the channel and you'd like to help support us, you can head over to patreon.com forward slash Modern Toy Fair. We've got a bunch of different tiers of different rewards. You can get some videos early. You can get uh, all the figure photography early. You can get input on the channel and the podcast. You can get physical prints of the photos I take, all sorts of stuff. We've got a couple of tiers that actually have seven day free trials. So you can try it before you buy it. The link will be in the description below. Now, right now on your screen, you're probably seeing the playlist for all the toy hunts and then also one of the two reviews, either Ryu or Mega Man. So go check that out. Also, before I forget, check out the live stream Wednesday nights at 10 p.m. Eastern Standard Time to see what we got. Anyway, that's good for this video. Hopefully see you next week. Same toy time, same toy fair channel. Thank you for watching. A huge thank you to our Patreon members, Super Tank, Jason Miller, Evan Hernandez, Aaron Samples, The 45th Lyric, Christopher, and last but not least, Boogeyman13.